lid on your creation. Hamburger is one of the most popular meat dishes in the world. So that is what a group of scientists at the Dutch Maastricht University chose for their first presentation of artificial food. They created the meat patty by putting stem cells from two organically raised cows into a nutrient solution, which helped them develop into muscle tissue. One of the volunteers who tasted it was Austrian nutritionist Hani Rötzler. There's quite some intense taste. It's close to meat. It's not that juicy, but um, uh, the consistency is perfect. The artificial hamburger still has no fat, an obvious factor in the taste, but it looks and feels like meat. Scientists point out that global meat production is at its peak and will not satisfy the growing demand in the next 40 years, so an environmentally friendly alternative is a necessity. Monday's test is the result of more than five years of research and an investment of more than $300,000. Scientists say they will continue to experiment in order to make the artificial beef taste more like a real hamburger. Reactions from the public are mixed. Test you meat, it's wrong, it's not right, these things shouldn't be going on, it's really, really disgusting. I think it's great because um, I don't think people should be eating meat. Scientists say they hope their artificial meat could help feed the world and reduce the environmental damage caused by conventional livestock production. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.